before he hit it, hit it big with American Gothic, like he was experimenting a lot. I think it's really interesting how Grant Wood painted what he knew because it gave him room to experiment and to put his own take on his home, his landscapes. It seemed like rebellion because his father wanted him to farm. He sort of is making you think about well, why does that represent America and what does it really mean to represent America. What is America? Who constitutes the American population? What, what is the country about? It seemed a wonderful idea to have the students involved with the Whitney Museum replicate this mural project. Grant Wood painted this mural for the cafeteria of McKinley Junior High School in Cedar Rapids, and he painted it with his ninth grade students from 1924 to 1925. The teens are going to be painting the mural in full. And in a way, having the students recreate the mural honors his vision more than if we had brought the mural from Cedar Rapids. I think it's really cool that he had his students involved in it to make art more accessible. Imagination Isles reminds me of something in a fairy tale, um, like something you read in a book when you're younger. He uses these bold colors and just doesn't put a lot of detail into the work, especially with what we're doing now. It allows me to put myself in the setting and to imagine what it would be like to be there and to think about different aspects of American life.